woman from the East who has come West with this husband. She's, she is after freedom and she wants to make her own thing. She is a modern woman of the day. So when, I, when I'm doing my research and I'm thinking about it, I'm going, okay, well, who do I think are ahead of their time now in my time? And I think that she was one of those women who was ahead of her time in her time. She's so smart. I underestimated her. That's, ugh, I don't want, ugh, that's shameful, but I did. This is a woman who preys on other women, but is still a staunch feminist. There are cribs, six or seven cribs out there their whorehouses and the miners come in and the railroad workers come in and I make money and they go out there and do their thing. That's where she came from. She came from that. That's what she knows. That's the business that she knows. But there are so many scars that come along with that. Canada is a great country. We have so many things to be thankful for and so many privileges. But there is this underlying ugh, that where, where we started that often gets overlooked, I think, that this show is bringing back up. Certainly it is for me, I'm going, oh, oh yeah. It's like nothing that I've ever experienced before. This is my first time doing a lead in the show. But yeah, it's just been a huge learning curve and I wouldn't, I wouldn't change it, like it's just been great.